Well, this is a confusing news. The king of Belgium has come back to Congo. After more than a decade, he's now been invited. And a lot of people are celebrating this, actually. But let me first show you what's happening before I say anything. The Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, has welcomed Belgium's King Philip in what is a historic visit to the Central African country that the king's ancestor once ruled brutally as his personal fief. The monarch arrived Tuesday and will undertake a six-day trip billed as a chance for reconciliation. Chisakedi and his wife greeted King Philip and Queen Mathilde on the red carpet rolled out on the tarmac of the international airport of the capital Kinshasa. On Monday, Congolese government spokesman Patrick Muyaya told reporters that Belgium and the DRC were starting a new partnership. Belgium's colonization of the Congo was one of the harshest imposed by the European powers that ruled most of Africa in the late 19th and 20th centuries. I wish that our president would take care of what's important to the Congolese instead of creating useless expense by inviting the royal couple. We have important things to settle here, like free education. Teachers are not well paid, but the president prefers to invite the Belgian king. To do what? To loot us again? First of all, this is a useless meeting, as that man said in the end. This is not going to bring any benefits. This man doesn't even have that much power in Belgium. Why not invite the Prime Minister if you want to discuss something? And also if this man was serious about apologizing and about making right what his fathers did, why didn't he bring something with him? Usually when you apologize to people, you should bring gifts. You should do some sort of a gesture to show how serious you are and to demonstrate that you actually feel sorry. But no, he came alone with nothing. He could have brought the remains of Patrice Lumumba. He could have brought all the things that his family stole. I mean, don't even bring all of it. Bring one item just to show that, hey, I am here to apologize. I'm here to actually return what we stole from you. But no, he comes here with empty words. What are those words going to benefit anyone? And then the government of DRC, they're actually spending money on this madness. He's spending money on inviting this man putting together all these lavish presentations for him to show him, you know, how welcomed he is. All these ministers in line, you know, smiling, telling this man to welcome. Come on, like, it's 2022. I mean, are we not past that? It is shameful to see in this day and age. This is very disappointing. What should have happened is what happened to the royals of Britain when they tried to visit Caribbean countries. There were lots of demonstration, lots of backlash. The people in Caribbean, they made sure that these royals know how much people hate them, how hated they are, and how little they matter to people. But here he's being welcomed. Anyways, I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please do remember to subscribe, like, share, and comment.